That's definitely an A. I couldn't even beat Gamma or Beta. Yeah, well, they're the top two robots, dude. You have to beat those guys to be the best. Gamma, because he took out every one of his brothers, and Beta, because he was... Uh, 102? And now we have Egg. We got him! Capture him first. Then you can have your revenge, Omega. Affirmative. Ready, old cannon! Open fire! It's time for the Egg Albatross. We have to get it, no matter what. Alright? Go! Okay! Affirmative. Now, I haven't got really any advice with this, uh with this boss because it's still a little bit of a, a difficult one with any team except for maybe Team Rose who just immediately destroys all the bosses I would try and take out the fans first if your homing attack will let you do that And try out, try and take out a lot of things with the tornado. Of course, you can't get absolutely everything with the tornado. Like, and the, the, the boost pad just gimped. Don't know why. Um, don't go into flying formation unless you have to, or if you want to take out the fans of the, uh, the, out, the Egg Albatross, then by all means do so. Slow down so you can catch up. Uh, ow. That was, that was a boss. That, that's crap. Shouldn't do that. Jesus Christ. That was lucky. Boss actually has three parts to it. Don't let your guards down. I know. You'll be careful too. Second wave approaching. Ready to attack. Yeah, don't get hit by the uh I'm gonna try and keep this team blast until the last phase because it'll be the easy. But yeah, just keep homing attack the, uh, the propeller there, and you should be fine. And the final do chaos control to beat the final part of the boss. Now, I believe I've at least got a C, C rank here. With this time. No, did you got a B. I, I didn't think I was going to get a B. I think, like, after three minutes, it's the C. I don't know, I can't remember. But, like, under two minutes, I believe, is an A. Which is absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> and it was a fake the whole time. Son of a bitch. Oh, and the uh, random shadow droid, for some reason. We didn't even see that in the boss. Shadow? Let's go. I don't know why that's there. Ultimate platform data has been copied.
you all ready? Chocola. Froggy. All right, and we're back with Sonic Heroes and back again with uh, Team Rose. It wasn't that long since we last left off with Team Rose. And I've already done it. Wow. The thing that I hated most about Amy, uh, specifically her playstyle, is the fact that she doesn't actually have a spin dash. So she has to rely on the Rocket Excel a lot more than the other teams. Alright, so you can use these fruit to actually jump. They act like a little bit like springs, launching you into the air. And those frogs actually make it, uh, make it rain. Make it rain! Which opens up a lot of the, uh, other areas of the game, so you've got mushrooms and, uh, fruits and even platforms. And I love how it just rains and then instantly it's just like, nope. Pathway here. Right. Big loop de loop. Platform catches us. Now, this is the point of the game where it actually really starts getting pretty hard. Uh, with the other teams, because this this level isn't so bad. Uh, later on, it gets a bit weird because of just the diff diff difficulty doesn't spike in a sense. Just like just you wouldn't think in a, a peaceful place like this that this would be like the fifth level of the game or the fifth world of the game, and you would think that it wouldn't be as hard. So yes, we have to use the tornado to get this flower to to fly. And now it's a falling sequence, so we've got to control our characters and get the balloons on the way down. So yeah, this, this level can be difficult. at times, but it's not like the worst level out of the whole lot, see if there's a goal in there. Then again, this is Team Rose we're talking about, so we might... <laughs> so you can finish the levels pretty dang quickly. And the difficulty doesn't, you know, really get really difficult for these guys. They, they, they stay pretty damn easy up until like, probably the final levels of the game. So like world seven is really when it starts getting a bit a bit more challenging for the for the easy players but it's still the, the levels aren't really that long it's just a lot of enemies and especially when you get to team sonic team dark that's when it starts being really hard in world seven uh but i like the levels in world seven actually the, the level uh, stage 13 and stage 14. So we start seeing more of these enemies. And the hammers really do hurt if you, uh, if you are not careful. And then we hit bad, uh, Bad frogs are actually black. It's okay, big. We can just take him out. Yes, big. This is one of the levels I don't really like. We 
have a couple of uh, little glitches there in, <laughs> in climbing up. You gotta be very precise with cream when, in terms of the vines, you've gotta be very precise on where you are to the vine. Because if you don't pick it up with cream and pick it up with anybody else, that's it. You're pretty much done. Uh, now it does say flying formation there, but I'm not sure if you can use any uh, homing attack, which I'm surprised she has because you know it's. Shadow and Sonic have it naturally, but Espio, as far as we know, has it naturally. But Amy's never had it, and she hasn't in this game. And I, that doesn't make any sense to me. And I got it. Bounce, bounce. Oh, what the hell? So be careful not to fall. So yeah, as you can see how many lives I've accumulated, and this is just off uh, playing from Casino Park onwards. So be careful not because every time you, you 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 quit out of a certain story, you lose all like you lose all your lives when you turn off the game, which is a bit of a bit of a bad thing. But you know, it makes sense. You. You've played up to that point, you should keep playing. The music track for this one I, I don't particularly enjoy too much, but it's because I haven't played this level as much as some of the others. See, so these black frogs aren't actually that bad because they take out enemies as well. Which is good. Which is which is the best thing. Yeah, these catcher robots are absolutely ridiculous. You get caught in their tractor beams, which uh, emulates out of their arms, which comes out of their arms, I should say. Then you get caught in a tractor beam, and you can't use that character up until you defeat that robot. Yeah, use a screen with like, what's <laughs> going on. <laughs> so I want to use Amy here. See, so with the Rocket XL, you've actually got a hold now. If you're playing the PS2, because this is a PS2 version. If you're playing the PS2 version, hold down the square button. Hold it down for maybe half a second to a second, then let go. You should get the speed boost then. If you press the uh, the square button, then you're gonna get Amy's ah, tornado spin move that pretty much does that nothing. Was good. So that was Lost Jungle and that was one of the uh, the weirder levels of this game. I don't particularly enjoy it as much as the others because I haven't went back to play it. I haven't had a re I found a reason to play it. Frog Forest I'd say yes because of the music but, but uh, other than that the level's not really there. Excuse me miss, I was wondering if I could ask you something. If it's about a date it'll have to wait. Jay? You think this is a joke you little brat? Now hand over that chow nice and easy. I bet you you're the one who took Chocolate Chow! So what? this is Team Chaotix. It's another team battle. Yeah! Time to rock and roll! Uh, we will be playing the Chaotix later, of course. We're actually beating the Chaotix twice in this playthrough, I just noticed. Team Dark in Grand Metropolis and Power Plant, and now here with <laughs> Team There's Rose. There's a major misunderstanding here.
And now Espio is just going to keep going in a loop. Wait a minute, what? I didn't even know they could use their team attack. Oh, and they come back. And now I've lost. Fuck. There's gotta be a major misunderstanding here, but we can't back down now. And that was the quickest battle ever. <laughs> Second go, and I beat them in like 20 seconds. I love that. That Like, I used to take forever on these levels, and then I seen someone play through this game, and they just kept using the tornado Sorry, from the speed characters. And I'm like, wow, that's actually really easy. Should try that, and now I keep... That's, that's the, the only motivation I have for this level. <laughs> uh... 25 emblems.